Hi, as investors, we're always looking at new ways to increase profit and provide service. The major change to this has seen us moving from single lets to HMOs, but with it came extra management required. In this video, I will show you how to add and configure a property, whether that be a single let, a HMO, or a commercial property you own or manage. Selecting the Configure Property option, you can change the property type and then select an option to change the room's configuration. The system has been pre-configured with templates, which can be altered as you wish. You can change how many bedrooms or units and select whether the rooms are for rent or not. You can then amend every unit and make notes including target rents and also add photos. From the actions button on the right hand side you can add a tenant. You can add the length of tenancy you can add their rental amounts and even their preferred payment method. You can also add any bills that are included. But don't forget to upload the documents regarding the assured shorthold tenancy but also the inventory for this unit. You can easily manage the finances and manage rent from within the unit financial screen. If you've forgotten to add a unit at any point, you can easily add an additional unit from the action buttons. From within the unit screen, you can also see any documents relating to each tenancy or unit. The Financials button on the top menu bar will show you the finances for the property. For an easy way to view the financials per room, simply drag the unit column up to the grey area. This will sort them by unit. The benefit is this can show you the utilisation over a period of time per room. Play around with this area and find a view that you like. Now don't forget to invite your tenants to the platform as they can raise any unit specific issues or chat to you regarding any questions they might have. This keeps all of your conversations in one place. Now don't forget to make sure your property is compliant. If it's red, it's bad. Simply add in the key dates for reminders of when the checks are due. Upload the relevant documents for safekeeping and protect yourself from any fines and complaints. For more videos on how to get the best out of the software, please see the links on this video or go to the help sections where our software is built by landlords, for landlords.